18-year-old IDF Armored Brigade Corporal Gilad Shalit was abducted on June 25, 2006 from his post on the Gaza Strip border. Two of his comrades were killed in the same incident when Palestinian militants from various organizations, including the Popular Resistance Committees, infiltrated his post near the Kerem Shalom crossing. Shalit's release has been a prominent issue among the Palestinian factions and, although Hamas denied it was part of the negotiations which led to the Mecca Agreement to form a national unity government, a prisoner exchange deal which would include the release of Shalit in return for Palestinian prisoners serving sentences in Israeli prisons, would definitely bolster the status among Palestinians of whoever manages to secure the deal. Egyptian mediators, headed by intelligence chief Omar Suleiman, have been instrumental in brokering the prisoner exchange deal. Israel released Sunday one of the founders of the Hamas military wing, Sheikh Saleh al aruri but Hamas denied it had anything to do with the prisoner exchange deal. Mahmoud Abbas promised Prime Minister Olmert he would try to release Shalit within a week or two prior to the formation of a unity government, but so far Abbas has not shown the clout to deliver on such promises. Gilad's father, Noam, refused to comment on Abbas's promise, saying it was mere speculation and preferred to maintain his silence after having given so many interviews to no avail.